for all of them. Do you realize that a serious allegation has been made against her? Went to Chandra Adams. The only thing she has in front of it. What's this letter from the Blue Bell Agents? That was a reference check. Hmm. Jane had two foster kids before the Adams girl. This other agency removed them. Two months later, she came here. Why were they removed? Means Jane experienced difficulty understanding her role as a foster parent. What does that mean? The children were found with soil clothes. Jane missed appointments with her caseworker. But, but she was new. The letter goes on to say, we recommend that no more children be placed with her. You felt comfortable placing three little girls with this woman? We had her take a parenting seminar. Seminar? And she moved back in with her mother. That was a provision. Dorothy Rudd has a long history with us. Still, it was Jane's care that you put them in. Believe me, if the Bluebell Agency had sensed any real danger, they would have taken steps to have her decertified. We worded that letter very carefully. Phone's call out, too. Did you ever think of reporting Jane to the state hotline? The violations we had evidence of weren't that extreme. Uh, the woman's a hobber. What? The city contracts out to 73 private foster care agencies. We're not interlinked. When we turned her down, she had uh, 72 more chances. And you're sure she's unfit? Yeah, I've been in this business 20 years. I interviewed Jane personally. The woman's not stable. We can't go after Jane based on a caseworker's bad feeling. We have Tanya's revised statement. Obtained after Tashandra took them. They're tainted. It'll never hold up. We haven't talked to Dorothy yet. If she turned a blind eye to the abuse, then she'll protect the daughter over the foster son. Then we gotta get to Glenn now before she gets a lawyer. Alex? There is King for a day. What, another video game? It's where we get a law guardian appointed who will play ball. He'll let us talk to Glenn, provided everything the boy says is off the record. And any law guardian will do this? It might take a little sweet talk. Hey, Glenn. You know why I'm here? I heard you were the guy to see about video games. You ever play Sword Quest? It's my game. 
fine too. I made it to level 13, bagged myself a Gorgon. I hate the Gorgon. Is that who took Cassie to the cave that night? No. It was me. Why? Who's hurting her? Glenn, it's my job to help kids who have problems with Gorgons. You have one in real life, don't you? Who is it? You don't have to worry. Remember? I'm a level 13 or she'll never get past me. Double these plates up, or you could have a total mess on your hands. Some of their paper plates that can leave you feeling blue. Get Dixie Ultra Plates, three times stronger than the leading store brand. Dixie, make it right. Trusted by pet owners for over 20 years, Frontline Plus is the number one name in flea and tick protection. With Frontline, you and your pet can go anywhere. No matter how you define it. Frontline, here, there, everywhere. The neighbor from 38A. A striking limb built of dark fruit and spice. what a horrible influence that video game was. Actually, it's very educational. The monster in it is based on Greek It's hard to rule over an entire organization, but with Monday.com Work OS, any team can cross collaborate, and now we're much more on point. Now I have everything I need to run my teams, from marketing to sales to even building tech. That's a reason to celebrate. How long has your wife been asphyxiating? No, that's crazy. Look, Sydney never done anything like that before. She's not that kind of person. And how long were you married? Six months. We were having problems. We decided to separate. How long were you together before you got married? Just a few months. That's quick. That's why we separated. Look, I think it's only been a couple weeks. I just went over to get a few things, and that's when I found it like that. Where were you before that? Working. I'm an artist. I have a loft over in Alphabet City. And uh, how come you two weren't getting along? Irreconcilable differences. What does that mean? Cheating? No. Look, just because two people love each other doesn't mean they can live together. Why? Why are you asking me these questions? I mean, somebody killed my wife. Who wanted the divorce? We hadn't decided to file. But I, I wanted the separation. We 
got married too fast. So then it is possible that your wife hid her sexual practices from you. Our sex life wasn't the problem. When, when I... <sighs> Do you know when you'll release my wife's body? I'll let you know. You gotta get the cases. Any right? alarm bells going off on the husband? Several. He's hiding something. Getting off while checking isn't something you share with friends and family. People are always shocked when they get the pen and news. I still think the victim was entertained. A new man or uh, probably got there earlier than he said. Well, she had a partner. It's manslaughter, whether the ME rules it an accident or not. The victim have any visitors besides the husband? The visitors law listed a Pam Adler and Amelia Chase arrived around lunchtime. Pam Adler, the criminal attorney? Yeah, Rose Adler and Klein. She cross-examined me on a drug bus where a cop got killed. Accused me of police brutality. Don't tell me the perp went to the hospital. The drug deal is still alive. The cop is. We'll take the lawyer since Finn's got history. Go. It's terrible. Did she suffer? We really can't answer that. Were you two close friends? Yes. We met at Vassar. We uh, had our whole lives ahead of us. And now she's dead. Uh, I just can't stop thinking about her. First the divorce and now this. We heard it was a trial separation. Six month old marriage and nothing but fights. Sydney couldn't take it anymore, so she called an attorney I know. Have you seen Sydney recently? She was supposed to meet Amelia and me for lunch. When she didn't show, we went over to the...